All right, here we go. We got uh, Joel Wales up against Fikret Sarik. Does Fikret have a fight name that you'd Fikret, like to share with us? The Bosnian Beast. The Bosnian Beast. I like Sarik. it. Sarik. Guy looks like a little beast, too. How old is he? Fikret is 29 years old, been fighting for four to five years, does Taekwondo and Bosnian kickboxing, but considers his base kickboxing and jiu-jitsu. Says he loves the fancy kicks. Fancy kicks are cool. Fancy kicks are cool. Current record is six and seven. Joel Wales, on the other hand, has been fighting for four years, considers his base wrestling, has been wrestling since he was four years old, trains out of get some, Mr. Brock Larson is in his corner tonight. I think that has to give you the advantage in this fight. You would think. I think you're going to see one guy try to take this to the ground and one guy keep it standing, maybe. Let's throw it up to Mr. Brown. We got here now. Bud Light, round one. claims that we have audio right now. Can you hear me? I can hear you. I can hear you. That's all that matters then. <laughs> all right, the Bosnian Beast and Joel Wales. Both these guys look to be in pretty good shape. This will be the last of our amateur fights tonight. Got a few pro fights coming up. We do. We have three very interesting professional fights later on tonight. All right, here we go. Touch, Touch of gloves. gloves. Don't say what I say, please. Damn you, Joe Rogan. <laughs> really right. knocking him up. Trying to get that take down. Right after him. No feeling out in this one. Nice reversal. Wow. I think he's got a head and arm from the bottom, maybe. I think he's really holding yes, on tight. Yeah. Maybe just to keep his posture. Yeah, there's no arm in there, Jared. I would have liked to have seen them wear different colored shorts. So from this angle, I could tell who we're looking at. Oh, there we go. I got eyes on now. Well, we know the guy in the red's going to win then. It was a very intelligent call right there. See, we have our time clock up on the uh, screen now, too. That's good news. Uh-oh. Scrambling for position here. Got him in turbo. Oh, oh. It's a big shot. I think he's got a crucifix what here. Is he? He's got that right arm trap. Working. Oh, take his back. Doing a good job of both of position. Stopping him up here. Putting in some good groundwork, that's for sure, but that's no surprise. You're kind of expecting that from Joel. I'm sure he's just kind of... Got to assume he's softening him up, trying to look for that choke. Still both hooks in. All defense here for the Bosnian Beast. It's in a bad spot. There you go, he's gonna turn into him. Joel doing a good job controlling the back though, that's for sure. Trying to get under that chin. Hard to tell from here, but is Joel bleeding from the left eye? We might need a different camera angle for me to answer that question, Mr. Tuma. I don't think he's got anything there. 
turning into him. Oh, goodness. Oh, nice nice reversal. Bosnia and Beast on top here. I think you are correct. Mr. Wales has a uh, cut over the left eye. Three minute rounds. Forgot this was an amateur foul. Good first round. Solid the first pace. Round. All right. Going to get that eye checked out. I think you might be done. No, there's the corner over there. I don't know what's happening. He's got a pretty good cut. Can we get Stitch in out. there to take a look at that? Stitch is in there looking at the cut on the left eye of Joel. Let him bang. He's nodding the affirmative here. Looks like they might let this go. He's fine. I think I just saw Brock say rub some dirt on it and get back in there. That usually helps to have a handful of dirt in your pocket. It slows the bleeding down quite and a bit. And you know Brock's always got dirt in his pocket. Yeah. How do you score that round? Goodness gracious. That's a lot of pressure to put on me. All right. The Bud Light girl is going to have to spin around here pretty quick. Seconds out. Let's go. Well, that was nice of the ref to uh, tuck Joel's jock back into his shorts for him there. Jeremy really taking care of the uh, lower region on the fighters tonight. Is that a guy is mouthpiece in the middle of the fight? All right, round two, here we go. No. Shook off the touch of gloves there, did Joel. Look at the smile yes. on the Bosnian beast, man. He's smiling. having fun. He is. I think he's going to target that eye. There we go. He kicked it. Trying to showcase a couple of those fancy kicks he was alluding to. Oof. Oh. Still smiling. He's having fun out there. Joel trying hard for a take. Oh. Has he got an arm trap there? Yep, he's looking for the arm bar. I know. All right, Joel doing a good job defending it. I don't know what we'd do tonight without this 32-inch monitor in front of us. Sure, that's on a six. Oh, he's really stretched it out. That's, that's it. Idea. He got that. Yeah. Joel Wales taps out to Armbar. Nice to the Bosnian beast. Hard to argue the jujitsu of Stomp MMA, Joe Giusecki. belt the Bosnian beast is under Joe? Is he a blue belt? Or? Uh, Joe wasn't very forthcoming with the information on uh, his jiu-jitsu belt. I do not have that information. Joe kind of likes to hoard his information, that's for sure. He's a hoarder of information. Proved a difficult man to get a hold of, but... Uh, he's a very important man, Joe Giusecki. <laughs> that is debatable, by the way. Oh, Joe's taking his shirt off here in the crowd. That was a good fight, though. And we'll throw it up to Mr. Brown for the official decision. I'm pretty sure the Bosnian Beast won, and I think Joel's going to want to get that eye looked at. He's got some swelling going on there. I'll admit that was a fun fight to watch. That was. Good sportsmanship there. Good fight, guys. Good job, Joel. 